Hello, everyone. Let's start our vocal warm up. First thing to do, find your feet. And if you're not standing, find your alternate feet and make sure that you are standing evenly on them. Feel your feet against the ground. Take your time. Now, I want you to shift your weight so you've got 80% of your weight on one foot. Switch sides, 80% on the other. Switch sides, 70%. 70%. Switch again, 60% on one side, 60% on the other. And now find that perfect balance. Make sure your toes are facing forward. Bring your shoulders up, back, and down. Let's do that again. Shoulders up, back, and down. And stretch up, over to one side. Stretch up again, over to one side. Stretch up, bring your hands down. Shoulders back up, back, and down. Now. Remind yourself that your toes are facing forward and just breathe in. And breathe out and collapse. Five. Now, when you breathe in this time, you're gonna breathe into count of two and your ribs are going to expand. So breathe in, one, two. Now leave those ribs out as you breathe out to two. One, two. Breathe in again. Your ribs should already be out and out to two. Good, now relax. Shoulders up, back, down. Strengthen your feet all the way up and let your head be a bobblehead doll. Okay, let's do that again. This time we're gonna breathe in to two and out to a count. You're gonna hold your candle in front of your face and the flame is gonna flicker just slightly. Okay, but it's gonna evenly flicker from the beginning of your exhalation to the end. So put it around right here, okay? And breathe into two, out to six on S. Four, five, six. Breathe into two, eight. Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Breathe into two. Thirteen. Four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen are still strong and relax. I hope that when you relaxed that last time, your body just naturally took in the air that it needed. Now, find your feet again. We're going to do some humming. So here's your pitch. Whatever octave works for you. You're going to breathe in with that nice expansive breath. Then you're going to hold the hum for about an eight count. And I want you to feel various places that that hum is going to go. So you could bring it through your forehead, through the top of your head, through your nose, through the back of your lips, through the back of your mouth. Just let it bounce around your head. Breathe in to two. Breathe in, do it again. Last one. And. Good. Now we're going to start here. And let's make a v sound. V. Good. Now lighten that up significantly so it doesn't actually sound like v anymore. 
your lips and your teeth are in the same place, but it sounds more like this. Ooh, it's very light. You would hardly tell that it's a V at all. And we're gonna slide up and down an octave. So it's gonna sound like this. Access that head voice, access that inner space in that high, soft palate. favorite a tongue trill which is harder to do now it's not fair to take a still screen a still a screenshot of this this is just for our use here tenors and basses at my register so in your head voice voice sopranos and altos also at my register we're going to take it low tenors and basses your goal is to keep in that head voice sopranos and altos your goal is to explore as we get lower explore that chest voice a little bit We're going to take it a little higher. So now you're going to go. register. So you'll feel grateful for that. Z Good. Two things. Remember that expansion of the ribs when you breathe and keep those ribs strong as you exhale. That's number one. Number two, when to put your hand here, and as you, after you reach the top note, you're going to expand. So you're going to wait to expand the dynamic until after you start that top note. I'll demonstrate once. Z
too low for you, you can just pop up the octave, no problem. And I really want you to feel that bounce at the bottom. One, one, in your own register. One, one, to this one. Make sure that you breathe for the higher note, not this note. Breathe for the higher note. And then make sure your vowel stays narrow. So instead of it's some matching, some, you know, ensemble singing. Since you're all alone in your house, at least you can sing with me. All right, so first thing we're gonna do is just sing a scale up and down together with the usual do, re, mi syllables. So do, re, mi, and I want you to really focus on matching my vowel. a little faster. So about this tempo, matching my vowel, three and four. Do, re, mi, fa, so, la, di, do, di, la, so, la, mi, re, do. Now let's do it in harmony. So I'll start, you come in, when I start the me, you're starting the do. So we'll have a little a bit of a canon here. My turn first. So I'm going to start on do. You come in on do when I get to me. Let's do that on a neutral syllable. I'll start. so much. I hope that'll start your day off with some vocal health. Come back and do it again tomorrow. Bye.
Additional resources can be found at berkshirechoral.org. Go to the Programs tab, click Singer Resources. There you'll find conductor chats, online listing events like our recital and Beethoven lecture series, and you can even sign up for online voice lessons.